Hello, everyone, and welcome. Um, I'm here to give you a sneak peek at our new customer service portal. You know, business has been going phenomenally, and we've added a ton of new consultants, but also with a, a, an increase in activity means an increase in requests, an increase in questions, an increase in traffic to our customer loyalty department. That means more emails, more voicemails, et cetera. So what the team has done is we've went out and we've created a new portal to help make this process more efficient, to make sure that you're supplying all the information that we need to solve any issues that you may be having, and also to categorize those issues so we can get the most efficient use of resources on any request that you have. So I'm gonna go ahead and, sc and screen share here and walk you through it real quick. Um, so if you're seeing the screen right now, this is gonna be the portal. You're gonna go in here and you're gonna set up a password and you can set your password to the same exact password that you have for your COO login, uh, which will be very cool. In here, there's gonna be a search, search bar and we'll talk about that in a second. But right here at the top right is where you click to submit a request. This is gonna take you to a form. There's going to be a number of customized or tailored options in here. You can ask, a, maybe you have a question about a consultant payout or a corporate event or a fraudulent charge or a media center question, uh, order questions, uh, personal event questions, or reporting questions. Um, most often we see people calling in with order issues. In this order issue form, once you click on that, it's going to pull up the form. It's gonna ask for every piece of essential information that we need to make sure that we're asking, we're answering your question and solving your issue. Um, in here also, there's gonna be issue type within the form. So is this a question about a back order, uh, canceling an order, an issue submitting, missing product or missing shipment? Um, you'll be able to go through here and fill that out and submit the request to our team. Now, we do have a lot of back and forth when we're trying to work these issues. We're spending a lot of time reading emails, making sure we have the right information. This is gonna solve for that. But what we also have the ability to is now to give you visibility to our ticketing system. That will mean when you click in here and you can look at my requests, you can see here, I submitted uh, something uh, that I wanted to have solved, which I said, my order keeps giving me an error message, right? I submitted that in here, um, you know, I was able to send in my issue, documented when it was created, when the last activity on that issue was. Also, Carrie from our corporate office responded to my issue. And uh, so I'm able to track the progress of that. I see the status here. I can see that back and forth. You also have the ability to CC other consultants on your request. So if you wanna CC your upline, or your sponsor, you can do that right in here in this second part. So, you know, we can all work together to be, make sure that we're solving the issues that are at hand, which is gonna be very, very helpful. Now, the last piece of this that I wanna show you, which is awesome too, is over time, we'll start to build up a knowledge base in here. For example, right now, the team can upload how-to articles. So one of the things that's come up quite a bit is IAP payments. So if I put in IAP payments in the search bar here, it pulls up an article about how to fill out my wallet, which is awesome. So my wallet right here walks you through how to fill out your wallet, how to submit your IAP payment, which is really, really awesome. So we look forward to launching this portal. There'll be more to come. We'll have a name. We'll have all kinds of, uh, of cool how-to videos on here as well. But look forward to this being launched and increasing the efficiency of transacting business with pure romance and getting your questions answered. So thank you all for your time.